sorting one group in different ways. Hey guys! Today I'm playing in the park. In the summer, all leaves are green and seem the same. And now, in the fall, they are of many colors and look so different from each other. Hi everyone! Yes, leaves change their color in the fall. But color is not their only difference. Hmm, what else is different? Look carefully. There are leaves of different trees in this heap. They don't look the same. Yes, the shapes of a maple leaf and an oak leaf are different. The oak leaf looks like an oval with a wavy edge. And a maple leaf looks like a star. Try to sort this heap into two groups. Maple leaves and oak leaves. I'll give it a go. Now the maple leaves and the oak leaves lie separately. Let's think how else these leaves are different. I know. Some leaves are big and some are small. Correct. What about sorting the leaves by size? Great! We've got a heap of small leaves and a heap of big leaves. Apart from the shape and size, is there any other way to sort these leaves? I think we can also sort them by color. They are all of different colors. Not exactly. Some leaves are yellow, some are red, and some are two-colored, yellow and green. Let us see how many leaves of each color there are. Sure thing! That's easy! Yellow leaves are the most, red leaves are less, and yellow and green leaves are the least. Even though these leaves have fallen off, they are still very beautiful. Should we make a wreath of them and hang it on the front door? That would look very pretty. Awesome idea! I'll do that! It'll be easy because I've already sorted the leaves by shape, size, and color. At our next lesson, we'll learn everything about patterns. See you soon! Bye, guys! Subscribe to our channel to stay updated on new videos. Find links to our apps in the comments below.